Do you know what custodians do for us? Do people take custodians for granted and treat them differently? Custodians are a very important part of society and without them our surroundings would be dirty. They often go unappreciated and sometimes disrespected. Most people don't understand the work that they do for us benefits us. We hope to show what custodians do and how hard they work to keep our environment clean and safe. We wanted to get an inside scoop on our head custodian, Conrad, who has worked as a custodian for over 20 years. Uh, 6.30, open up, uh, open all the doors to the school, turn on all the uh, lights at uh, 8.15, put up the flags, open the doors for the sub to two teachers. That's about it. Then I come to the cafeteria. We sat down with our school psychologist, Mr. Witte, who has worked at Camino for the past 11 years to ask him about the importance of our custodian. Past messes. Well, I think, you know, walking into the lunchroom, the first thing that I think about is, you know, kind of lunch tables all messy and things kind of spilt over milk or food or this or that. Um, the gum out in the courtyards, one of those things of all the little gum things. I think some of that gum's been there since 2004 when I first got here. So I think. Mike, who has worked as a custodian for over 15 years, had some thoughts and feelings towards the treatment of him and his colleagues. Uh, the fact that sometimes it feels like the work that we do isn't really appreciated as much as you would think. We went in and um, clean the gym before the, the basketball game that we had here. I had two hours of basketball and it looked like we hadn't even touched the gym or cleaned it at all. Eugene, our newest member to the team, gave us a rundown of his daily routine. Daily routine, well, first thing we do is do trash in all the classrooms and then we start sweeping and picking up and making the rooms neat. And Gabe, who has worked at Camino for eight years as a custodian, shows how he handles stress and pressure. Stress and pressure. Take a walk. I have to walk. Miss Martinez, our newest fax teacher, who has worked at Camino for one year, already expresses her gratitude for our custodians. I think they work extremely hard. I think our lead custodian, Conrad, stays busy all day, and our night custodians work really hard all evening. We sat down with our custodian of 30 years, Joe, to discuss the worst janitorial experience at Camino. Mopping the piece from the restrooms, <laughs> been having it for three months, every day. We wanted to get a look on the importance of our custodians from our principal's perspective, so we chose to speak with Mr. Ramos, who has been with Camino for eight years. Litter's gonna happen, but I think the thing that's disappointing is when we do have uh, people in general that forget to pick up their tray on their own in the cafeteria, uh, forget to, uh, you know, it, they're being lazy. We sat down with Camino Real's art teacher, Miss Ashley, who has been with Camino for two years and asked her about her thoughts towards the duties of our custodians. The custodian takes care of our school. They maintain it. They make sure that it's clean for us. You know, uh, simple things like throwing trash when there's a garbage can right there, things like that. It just goes to show that they don't appreciate it. Students, uh, some students do some things on purpose just to make our, our job, you know, miserable. That's what I don't like. 